welcome to all myself professor deshmukh means presenting the theory lectures based on tribology having unit name that is elasto hydrodynamic lubrication and the gas lubrication there are in the two part after this two part we will see the first part that is the elasto hydrodynamic lubrication in that we are having to making the two part that is part 1 and part 2 part 1 is showing all about the how the elasto hydrodynamic lubrication is occur now in this case we see the overall types and what is comparative difference of the elasto hydrodynamic lubrication now there is the types of uh, the lubrication first that is the hydrodynamic lubrication so what happen in this case the lubrication is solely because of the dynamic action of of given body okay if there is a shaft is there shaft is rotating in the bearing means what due to the rotations of the bearing that it create the convergence area which will be support by the fluid flow to the shaft figure show that there is a gauge formation between the shaft rotation and that of your the reservoir inner area which will be cause the high pressure fluid flow development which will be support the load acting on the shaft which prevent the contact with the two surfaces so this is all about hydrodynamic bearing a lubrication now look at this how the pressure is developed that already discuss look at the figure figure show that there is pressure development at the bearing areas which depends upon viscosity now the point contact hc upon r is equal to 288 pi square upon 25 eta u r upon toys w bracket square Now come to the our point that is elasto hydrodynamic lubrication E H D. The two variables of hydrodynamic lubrication. That is surface. That 
Adelas to hydrodynamic lubrication RW eta 0 Q alpha E. The ASC depends upon the parameters. Okay. Now there is a pink ball showing that there is a elastic deformations will be happen at the point areas where blue line is straight line. S0 means what minimum fluid thickness. Now these are the formulation that is C upon R. K in bracket alpha E star A into eta 0 Q dash ER beta W upon ER square C. So which depends upon material, speed, load. Another formulation is showing that IC upon R. Look at this. It depends on the load is very weak. 2 raised to 0 0.67 is equal to 1.048. Hamburg Dawson equation. The clarifications from lab manual we got that A dash is equal to twice A dash. So Hamburg and Dawson equations, the clarifications from the lab manual A star is equal to HP upon R is equal to 1.90 u raised to 0 0.67 w star raised to 0 0.067 g raised to 0 0.53 where u is equal to mu eta oil ar w g dash is equal to phi r upon rb so where u is equal to rolling velocity eta oil is a zero pressure oil viscosity eta is equal to oil viscosity at higher pressure alpha is the pressure viscosity index from equation eta is equal to eta oil xp alpha p so this is all about part 2 it is quite easier to understand in that we are basically see the what are the types of lubrications how it occurs and that of equation is very important here Amrock and Dowson equation HC upon R is equal to 1.9 twice alpha E 0 0.53 eta 0 U twice ER 0 0.67 W upon twice E R square plus 2 minus 0 0.67. So, this is all about your elastic dynamic part 2.